So here's another awesome Malix file. This is Spider-Man and of course I've primed it and I've sanded it, glued it up and used some accelerant. And now it's time to fill in the cracks. I use this Bondo glazing compound. It's for finer detail and I kind of use it to smooth out some of the pieces parts. I then went ahead and spray painted it with just rattle can uh, lacquer, black lacquer. I was going for a different costume look. And then I actually used these paint markers to get into the sort of cracks and crevices where I really thought I'd be able to use it were all these lines and I did and it really really worked well sort of skating over the lines instead of trying to use a brush now I did use a brush sometimes as you can see with the eyes and some of the other parts but for the most part I did this with uh, those markers and it came out really well I was really pleased with it now the base is uh, something I always have fun with because it's sort of you know you're just sort of putting paint down and moving things around and I enjoy that and I start with the uh, gray, uh, which I believe is actually just the primer, and then went ahead and put down a coat of blacks and grays. And then you're really just building up depth. And so, you know, how we do that is, you know, you picture where the light's coming from, you pick a light source, and you add your highlights. You can see it in the upper right hand corner, and you add your shadows, and that'll give it depth. And here it is, Spider-Man. I love this pose. Uh, the file was really easy to print, really easy to put together. Uh, you can check out the links to uh, Malik's 3D Design and the links in the description below. You can also find links to any of the paints or supplies I use, like the brushes or the markers. Had a lot of fun with this. Again, check me out over on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram under 3D Printed Props. And of course, head over to the Patreon page to uh, sign up to be a patron if you want. For a buck, you can have access to, you know, all the 3D files I've been putting together and I've got much more coming out. I want to thank you guys for watching and be looking for a new video up very soon.